Hello Capricorn, so today we are going to be doing a general reading for you. I'm going to be doing a general energy, love and career and I've never done the separate zodiac signs before so hopefully this resonates for you. If it does, please let me know down below and if it doesn't then that's totally fine. You can just move on, pick another, pick a card reading or anything like that. So let's just get right onto it. So first we're going to be looking into your general energy. So let's see what you guys have for the rest of April. I need to pull up my sleeves because I'm very hot. Right, let's see what you guys have for the month, rest of the month of April. So Capricorn, what's going on with Capricorns for the next two weeks? We've got body movement. Parenting and children. Beauty, get off, <laughs> there's a bit of dust, and inner power. So I was literally just thinking about this card, literally just thinking about it. So it's obviously, I was obviously just channeling your energy. So basically, I feel like you guys need to move your body more, whether that be going outdoors and having some time to play. <laughs> it literally says play time. The dolphins know the importance of playing as joy creates miracles and manifestations. So it's just getting everything moving at the moment, making sure you guys are getting moving. I'm just going to pick an animal spirit card, see what the emotional energy is for the next couple of weeks. There's also a lot of noise going on outside. So if you, if you can hear like ice cream trucks and stuff like that then that is that <laughs> so we've got be spirit sweet results await and claim your independence with your energy i'm basically saying that i feel like you need to um get moving as in like maybe dance a little bit uh get out and do some running do some exercise something that gets you moving maybe listen to some music and dance around your room something like that um i feel like you need to contact somebody as well. I'm getting like contacted somebody that you haven't talked to in a while. Maybe you've been thinking about them or I don't know, I feel like a friend. You need to contact a friend. I don't know, something like that. It's like contacting somebody. I'm not sure what that's about, but if that's reson if that resonates, then that's a sign. And I feel like you need to look after your external uh, body as well. So you're maybe like have a bath, maybe like Take the time to treat yourself because it's all about beauty and like your inner beauty and letting the outward beauty shine and come out and bring it out to you. So it's showing off to other people and this is going to draw people into you. I feel like you need to take time for yourself as in like take time on your outer, per like your outer looks. But obviously this could this could mean anything really simple like this could also be eating something really nice just like little things and we have sweet results away and claim your independence so there's something that's a bit shaky it's on shaky ground at the moment I feel like your energy is on a bit of shaky ground because we have the claim your independence so I feel like there is as I say we have the we have the B spirit as well so sweet results away so there are sweet things coming there are sweet things that are coming towards you if you're feeling like your ground is a bit shaky. And we also have inner power and claiming independence together. So it's bringing your independence out and bringing your inner power out. And it's claiming the confidence that you already have inside you. And also maybe take time for your family. Maybe be with your family or um, be with your children if you have children. Or this could be a situation to do with a family member. I'm just going to pull... A rider weight tarot card and we're just going to see what the overall energy is for the next couple of weeks just to give a bit more information because i feel like there's so many mixed energies here so you have the king of swords yeah i definitely feel like you guys are embodying this energy um just taking time out for yourself and being this strong independent person that you are and to also decide how independence what independence means to you as well this doesn't mean doing every single thing on your own this could just mean what makes you happy and that can kind of increase your confidence and increase your independence and just doing things that suit you and really focusing on what you what your values are and what you value in life and what you value as important to you so it's all very good it's all good good it's all good good <laughs> i've never really said that in my life but yeah it's all good so let's see what you guys have for your love so we have getting to know each other heart-to-heart -heart conversation so I definitely feel like there's a friend 
coming through there's a certain friend that you need to have a chat with i'm not sure who this is i'm, I'm getting like a girlfriend so as in like if you're a girl it'd be a girl if it's a guy it'll be a guy um it's some sort of friend that you need to talk to i'm feeling like someone you need to message someone contacting i'm seeing like a dove and then like sending them a message so maybe this could be a message of love as well if it's to do with a love interest i just noticed that this card this guy had a plait in his hair and it just looks really strange <laughs> I don't know why that's really strange. Maybe that's you plaiting your hair. <laughs> I don't really know. But yeah, so, because I said about outer beauty, so maybe it's that. I don't really know. Um, but yeah, so that's very strange. But there we go. Okay, so let's see what else is going on for you in love. Oh, whoop. wow, King of Cups. Hello, he just shot right out there. So this could be someone offering you love. This could be you offering somebody else love. We also have the Eight of Swords. And we also have... What else do we have? The Two of Pentacles. So yeah, I feel like you guys are weighing up decisions. You guys... This is general, so this could... There's a quite a few different messages coming in. Okay. One of the messages is there's two people or there's somebody at work that you like. Um, there could be somebody in a kind of triangle with somebody I feel like someone's like I don't know like a sibling's friend so say if you've got like a sister or a brother and you like their friend that's kind of what I'm getting it's kind of like that juggling act I don't really know and uh, we also have what else we got so there's somebody coming in that you want to get to know and heart to heart conversation so there's somebody I feel like you're going to have a good a really good conversation with in the next couple of weeks as I say whether that be with a friendship or that be to do with a relationship let's just see uh let's have one more card what's the overall energy for capricorn for love i'm getting quite a few scattered messages so i'm getting like half-hearted messages so i feel like in your relationships you i feel like you've not been heard for a long time and i feel like now you're deciding to be heard and not to have half half-hearted conversations you want full-on deep conversations so the overall energy is the Page of Swords. So I definitely feel like you guys are really getting out there in the sense that you guys are um, recreating yourself and getting the words recreating yourself, creating a new adventure, a new situation for yourself that's going to bring you in new love. As I say, this could be improving your personality, as in like bringing out the best parts of you. This could be improving uh, the way you look on the outside, on the inside. Do you know what? It just could be anything. It's just inner confidence is shining out. So we also have the badge of spirit. Be fearless and bold. So this could be, as I say, messaging somebody. Or someone could be messaging you. But I don't feel like with a be fearless and bold, this is definitely you. Um, it's a very kind of grounded card. So there's some sort of message that's kind of going to come through. That's going to, yeah, my throat's starting to like hurt. So I don't feel like messages are going to come through. Through your throat chakra. So you're going to be having a quite a long conversation with somebody. And it's being fearless and taking that step. And the possibilities are, are actually endless. And the possibilities are amazing because we have the page. And this is a new sort of situation. So I, this could actually generally be a new person. With this Eight of Swords, I feel like it could be past relationships. Or you could be in the middle of two people and you're not sure where to go. Yeah. Yeah, okay. So I think that's it for love. I hope that made sense. So let's see what's coming through for you in your financial section, careers, jobs, that kind of thing. Kick up your heels. Making new friends. I say friends are a really big thing in the next couple of weeks. And problem resolved. So this, I definitely feel like it's to do with the friends again. Um, yeah, so you could actually, friends could be helping you with your job, you could meet new friends at work, um, you could be starting a new job and that's where you meet new friends. So, what's the overall energy for Capricorn's money, please? You have the Emperor, oh this is nice, I like this energy, very grounded, very strong, the Tower, wow, you, I swear a lot of you guys... Uh, all the different zodiac signs, we've got the tower or death or some sort of like strong thing happening. So, okay, so this is what's going to go down. So you are embodying this emperor energy, this strong independent energy and say you're coming into your independence. There's some sort of tower moment that's coming towards in your money. This could be a sudden like, I want to say drain of your money, which doesn't sound good, but 
this could be a sudden like oh my god I need to sort this out this could be like debt coming in this could be um yeah like you maybe owe money or this could be to do with a sudden um thing that you get fired which I'm sorry to say but maybe but I feel like it's a positive thing because it's going to bring you into something so much better for you and something a new place a new position a new opportunity where you're going to be conversing with new people this could also be a new time where you're going to be conversing with people who are actually more on your level and it's a problem resolved so what's basically going to happen is you're going to be coming out of your shell you're going to be coming out into this new opportunity this new adventure that i don't think you actually see coming that's the thing i'm feeling it's like like oh my god like wow like holy crap I feel like it's really going to shake you up but it's definitely something good but just keep on the lookout and uh, make sure you're saving up money and keep your money safe is what I'm getting it's nothing bad so don't worry don't worry um just be careful with your monies I think as well is make sure you're not spending too much I think that might be as well as to be confident in yourself because normally when when people spend too much or overspend or have an addiction to spending it's normally because they're missing out on some sort of other part of their life in love life or emotionally some sort of thing like that so it could be like you're holding on too tightly to your money and it's not um and it's almost like the fear and the fear is like kind of coming and biting you in the bum so yeah i feel like you guys are starting to settle a more confident um smoother situation with your relationship with money okay so thank you for watching guys if you like this video please comment down below and let me know if this resonated with you that's amazing if it didn't that's totally fine you can feel free to pick a card reading or you can just do whatever you want <laughs> so thank you so much for being here please feel free to subscribe i'm having a easter sale from the 11th to the 22nd of april so if you guys would like a half price reading at 16 pounds and go for that i also have my other two other readings that aren't half price but just let you know if you're interested then let me know and i'll see you all very very soon bye